Does it mean that uh, the media business will now pivot to uh, emphasize editorial integrity, for example, ahead of uh, advertiser interests? Just uh, interject. Uh, I, I, I honestly, I, I take umbrage. I take umbrage. I take umbrage. I take umbrage. I take umbrage in the comment. The SPH media will continue to do the job we have done so well for so long. So this CEO flat out the reporter and just because of this, many Singaporeans are condemning him and a lot of attacks on social medias that suddenly make him so famous. Mm. But what's wrong with that when he was replying back to the reporter? I thought this is not new to us unless our eyes are very small. <laughs> So are we seeing what is within Singapore but not beyond the horizon? A few years back, there was someone but at the CNN reporter fake news at the press conference too. CNN, you fake news. Moreover, how do we expect him to reply to that reporter when she was questioning him about the editorial integrity of the company that he's fully responsible of? It's like what happened when someone asks you in the public, is your wife having an affair outside and you're wearing green hat now? <laughs> My head's blue. You get what I'm saying? Don't tell me that Singaporeans are not sensitive to this since Singaporeans are always sensitive to almost everything, right? So do we explain your answer back in a black way without any facial or body expression? If I may just interject. Hi, I honestly, hi, I did embrace your first question. Hi, Arigato Bozaima. As polite as a Japanese, or behave just like a kindergarten teacher. Hello, CNN reporter. What you say about us at your first question is really hurting my feeling and our company's reputation too. So I really cannot understand why should we be so narrow-minded and also very sensitive of how he's responded at the press conference. His behavior is nothing special at all. Sometimes when you see other world leaders behave in the same way like him, we will sometimes even marvel at them. But when Singapore leaders behave in this way, why is it so unacceptable? Are Singapore leaders supposed to behave in a very special way from others? This cannot do and that cannot say. Some could even mock him lack of education. Lin Bei now see Bei Tu Lang with your question. How dare you question Lin Bei like this, huh? Did he behave in this way? And do many of us know the word embrace too? Also, what's wrong of him using his finger pointing? Cannot meh. So we receive this kind of small freedom of expression. In many other countries, a lot of politicians and leaders in Green Li Guan Yu were doing this too. Point, 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 point. Mm. Point, 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 this and that. Hence, finger pointing should be a very common way of expression. Or do we expect him to use this kind of way? The purpose of doing this is to make sure that SPH Media will continue to do the job we have done so well for so long. Very good, right? And who is the idiot actually invented this? It's not scientific at all. And then because of the way we're responding, some were criticizing that he was using military way of treating the reporter. So is that the case? Shouldn't it be like this? Hey you, get this woman reporter out and slap her face 100 times. Pia, 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 pia and bring her out to eat dogs. Fit or eat. No wonder we need foreign talents to replace us la if we keep on thinking in this way. <sighs> Just think about it. If Lee Kuan Yew were the CEO, what would be the scenario be? It would be even more crazy. So leave a comment, share and subscribe and we should be more open to child.